Good morning, guys. Welcome to another beautiful day in this incredible canyon. It was a good night's sleep last night. Temps are pretty decent. I'd say it's 45, 50 degrees right now, which is pretty, pretty amazing for uh, late September. Fell asleep to the sounds of that waterfall in the background. Such a cool spot. Waiting to get up. It's uh, there's no rush basically, you know. Um, so we'll get up eventually here, have some breakfast, and uh, then get back in the water. We'll see what today holds. Get those squats going. There we go. It's really good uh, hazelnut artificial instant coffee beverage right here. Loving that. Mm. That is good. All right, we're on a mission. Had my coffee, my breakfast, warmed up a little bit in camp, and uh, it's time to finally make some casts down to these beautiful waterfalls. It would be so cool to catch a fish in that location. So let's get down there real quick, and uh, we'll work these pools, see if we can find some fish under these stunning spring waterfalls. There we go. First fish of the day, and you already know, in such a beautiful location. Man, how cool is this? Nice rainbow during sunrise at the base of these waterfalls. He's a jumper, he's feisty. That'll wake you up for sure. So cool. Off he goes in the reflected morning light. I think we can find a few more fish in this pool. Certainly looks good. There we go. Just like that, next cast in, one more fish. Beautiful brown. All right, we're getting into the real juicy stuff here. Right below the waterfalls, moving up into it now. God, I would love to catch a fish under here so badly. What a unique place, and there we go. Brown trout on. How freaking cool is that? Oh my God, what a special place. Fantastic, ridiculous, so amazing. So happy right now. Nice size fish too. There we go, yes. Beautiful waterfall brown. Man, that is just so awesome.
from fishing a beautiful waterfall to fishing this incredible cliffside pool here. It's just one hit after another. This place is so fun, so engaging. So, such a visual treat to fish this place. And man, the fish are hungry and they're everywhere. And there's another one right there, right off the bat. Oh, this makes me so happy. Next hole, another stunning waterfall. Big, big pool here. I think there could potentially be quite a few fish hanging out in here. Finally out of the shade and into some nice warm sunlight. But along with that comes potentially spookier fish. But <laughs> for now, would that take two casts? And uh, we're already on to a nice fish in this incredible big hole here. Man, this is so cool. Look at that. Wow, wow, wow. I'd fished this canyon previously in a different area and it was like more pocket water. And uh, the zone that, that we've been in here is just like one big ledge waterfall after another. Really interesting topography, really fun. Nice brown, all right. There we go, fish number two here. Spunky little guy. All right, heck yeah. Oh my God, look at this spot. Fish on immediately, first cast. All right. Waterfall after waterfall today. That has been the theme of the day. That and lots of fish, of course. What a beautiful, awesome day. Let's see if I can pop this guy downstream a little so I don't disturb the rest of the pool. Ideally because there's definitely some more fish in here to be had. There we go. Oh, had a bite right off the bat there. Didn't connect with them. 
There we go. Little guy. But you can't really complain in a place like this. Nice little brown. Okay, right away. My line hadn't even gone tight yet. Completely slack. This rainbow must have been right up, uh, right up, right near the surface. Hit that nymph immediately, right when it hit the water. Really cool. All right, man, having an awesome time out here. So good, so so good. We're gonna have to figure out how to uh, get up this waterfall to keep going upstream, but I think we'll find a way. Nice solid rainbow here. Whoa, buddy. Come here. <laughs> there we go. That hole is over. Here goes nothing. Doesn't look too bad, actually. Oh yeah, no big deal. <laughs> Pretty fun though. Makes me feel like a kid again. Man, another massive plunge pool here. Definitely got those same tricky complex currents, but um, I'd say this is still pretty doable. It's definitely fishing here, and um, hopefully we can find one. And we just did. Woo! <laughs> oh, 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 okay, okay, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, yes! <laughs> we lost the fish, but we got hung up about four times in a row there. <laughs> Somehow got it back, so we'll take that as a win. Wow, barely barely escaped alive there. I need to calm down. Let's uh, let's get some more fish. That was a pretty nice brown too. He was jumping all around. That was pretty awesome. <laughs> that's like that's like the thing, right? Like whenever you hook into a fish and it spits the hook. Inevitably, your your line, it's it's going, it's going into the trees always, 100% of the time. And um, oh my God, yeah, I got it hooked in the one tree, yanked it out real quick to try to try to avoid a uh, terrible fate, and then it popped over there to that tree, then back again. I'm uh, I'm incredibly lucky that I got that fly bag. That's for sure. <laughs> there we go. Oh, this feels like a nicer fish here. Much nicer. Oh yeah. Took a deep, deep, strong run there. Wow, it's actually not even that big. That, just, that fish just went, it went strong. <laughs> it went real hard for a second there. All right. Come here, buddy. There we go. <laughs> that fish fell huge. <laughs> Just a strong fighter, pretty cool. Oh, a ton of fish in this pool right here. 
they're starting to come into focus. I think there's maybe a dozen fish down here. Not always a good thing, you know. One of them gets spooked, you're pretty much screwed. But for now, I am seeing quite a few fish. Here we go. This drift looks really good. Coming right into the school. There we go. There we go. Let's get you back down here, away from your buddies. Looks to be a pretty nice rainbow here. That was a really fun catch. Seeing them like that, sight fishing to them, making a good cast. That's what it's all about. All right. Let's see if we can pick up some more fish out of this school. Here we go. Fly inbound. I don't think it got down quite deep enough. Got to get it. We got to get a little closer here. Here we go. This might work. Nothing. They could very well be spooked as well. That's what I was talking about. When you see, you know, a big school of fish, sometimes it's it's a bad sign. I mean, I definitely see them down there. I I feel like they. You know, they should have hit my fly. Uh, we'll try a few more casts though. You never know. Letting it go real deep. No takers. Let's move up just a tiny bit more. If we can cast further ahead, we can give the fly a little bit more time to get down, get settled into its lane. There's one. That was a different guy though. He was not in that school, you know, he was kind of off to the right underneath that ledge there. We'll take it all the same though. Absolutely. Another beautiful fish in this beautiful place. There we go. There we go. Fired up fish here. Fish on. Oof. Oh, he's fighting pretty well here. Oh yeah, nice size rainbow. Don't come down here. No, no, no. All right. Oh yeah, got, got some nice strong shoulders on this one. Solid fish. Took off like a freight train too. All right.
Oh man, we have found uh, the perfect hole here. Just look at this thing. Right along a cliffside. Looks absolutely incredible. We know there's gonna be some fish in there. Hopefully it's just a matter of time. I'm gonna work right along the edge here. See what we can come up with. There we go. There we go. Nicer fish here. Real subtle bite. Got him right down deep there. I was kind of hesitating on whether to set the hook or not. Real glad I did. Oh yeah. This guy's got some nice weight to him. Oh, nice brown, really nice brown. This will be my biggest fish of the trip for sure. Funny enough, I just switched away from the uh, Tenkara Rako Rocky to the uh, Teton because the fish that I have been catching were, you know, tending to be a little bit smaller and I wanted something with a little bit more give, a little more flex. <laughs> and then we get the biggest fish of the whole trip. Next hole. That's all right, we still got him in control. This is a really nice, good looking fish right here. I'm gonna have to pop down off the rock, try to land this guy. My line is actually pretty long on this rod, so I'm gonna play him just a little bit longer here, and uh, hopefully we can get him into the net. Really nice fish though. There we go. All right. What a solid fish. That was such an enjoyable fight. Just beautiful. Man, we saw some crazy stuff today, didn't we? Just the most scenic, wonderful day of fishing that I have had in a very long time. Really magical, to be honest. And um, we caught so many fish, and we saw so many beautiful sights. Before you go, give me a few seconds to tell you about some cool stuff I have going on. Besides a YouTuber, I'm a nature photographer as well. Head over to my website at flickyflies.com to see a selection of my images available as high quality prints. On my Patreon, you can support me directly from as little as $2 a month and receive perks such as watching my videos ad-free, behind-the-scenes content, 
personalized shout outs at the end of every video, and more. Another easy way to support me is by shopping directly through the links or using the coupon codes found in the description below the like button. Filming my adventures is a labor of love, but it's something that I'd like to make a little more financially viable. Any extra support is extremely impactful and greatly appreciated. Thanks so much for being here. I'll catch you next time.